Can't hide anymore. Thomas exposed Meg's 20 year secret to Harry, Meg arrested when she was a teenager. Megan's relationship with her father, Thomas, is getting worse and worse. He's heartbroken to have a daughter like her, ready to give up his family for a man. Thomas recently exposed Megan's past to Harry. He alleges Megan was once arrested for taking drugs in a bar when she was a teenager. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are facing fresh attacks courtesy of the Duchess's father, Thomas Markle Sr., who has launched his own YouTube channel to share his truth. Thomas launched his YouTube show in collaboration with celeb reporter Carl Larson and in the first episode launched an attack on Harry and Meghan, calling them out for giving him paradoxical advice about failing to avoid media attention. The Duchess of Sussex's father claimed that he was asked by Prince Harry to avoid talking to any reporters in advice that he says Harry did not follow himself. It amazes me that a man that tells me don't talk to anyone rides on top of a bus on Hollywood Boulevard doing an interview, said Thomas. He went on to further call Harry out, saying, It amazes me that they go on Oprah Winfrey for hours and sat there for hours and talk and expose things they shouldn't be exposing to anyone. And I think it's so disrespectful to the royals, I have great respect for all the royals. Meghan has notably not met her father since before her 2018 royal wedding to Prince Harry. In 2021, Thomas Markle sued Coleman Rayner, claiming that an agreement between both parties over some stage photos had ruined his relationship with his daughter, Meghan Markle. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry didn't invite Thomas to their wedding after the news broke. In the past days, other members of her family have also appeared on TV, speaking about the Queen and her passing. Meghan Markle has come under fire over the trail of destruction she has left behind on her family following a series of bombshell claims made to the public. The Duchess of Sussex discussed her non-existent relationship with her dad in a candid interview with New York Magazine's The Cut in September of last year, claiming she had lost him since marrying to the royal family. The former actress then released an explosive Netflix docuseries with Prince Harry, who claimed his wife doesn't have a father. Speaking to the Sky News Australia on Tuesday night, GB News host Nigel Farage said that he feels most sorry for Thomas Markle, who's a very good, decent, hardworking man. Quote, a man not on a particularly big salary, who spent a fortune getting his daughter educated, put through college, and when she married into royalty, she decided he wasn't quite good enough, he wasn't quite smart enough. Farage said Meghan and Harry are very unpleasant people who don't care about their family and friends. They leave a trail of destruction behind them wherever they go. Whether it's family, friends, staff, everybody falls out. In America, even the West Coast, their popularity poll ratings are the lowest that they've ever been. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will be deposed in her estranged half-sister Samantha Markle's defamation case, a Florida judge ruled on Tuesday. Judge Charlene Edwards Honeywell dismissed Meghan's motion to avoid testimonies, ruling that the Duchess of Sussex does not show any unusual circumstances that justify the requested stay, or that prejudice or an undue burden will result if the court does not impose a stay. Meghan does not satisfy the high standard required to stay discovery pending the resolution of a dispositive motion. Samantha had demanded that Meghan and Harry be deposed in separate interviews, claiming in court documents obtained by Fox News that, to date, the Duchess has not agreed to schedule one single deposition. Samantha also requested the depositions of her father, Thomas Markle, her daughter, Ashley Hale, former royal aide Jason Knopf, and online security expert Christopher Boozy.